Hey guys, welcome back. So uh, today's a big day. Lost Ark is launching. Uh, it's a game I've been waiting to try for a while. I've been doing my best to not do any research on it. Just I've just looked into some of the classes and stuff like that. But um, yeah, I was having some issues logging in. I was finally able to verify all the files and uh, download uh, and download the rest of the game. So yeah, let's get into it. So I've looked at all the classes, and I am going to play a War Dancer. So, let's get into it. Okay, what do we got? Ooh, that looks sick. That looks sick. That looks sick. Let's do this one. Definitely the weeb one. Okay, we'll save that in slot one. Oh, that's cool. You can change all the backgrounds. Okay, let's see what we want our character to look like. Let's do a couple randoms and see if we find any that look cool. Nah, nah. That looks pretty cool. I don't know why there's a bunny in her mouth. Ooh, that's pretty trippy. Ooh, that's really cool, actually. I think we'll go with this one. Cool. Let's see what we got. Can we get Palatial? We got it. Palatial has always been one of my MMO names, so we'll stick with that. Hmm... What's power pass? You do not have pass and therefore cannot use one. Okay. Okay. How do I exit out of this? Okay. Hmm. Okay. Well, let's go ahead and launch. So we'll attack with right click. Interesting. So we're on QWERTY. Basic control skills. Pick up interact. G. Movement stand up. C attack. T auto move. Okay. Well, we're going default mode for sure. Cool. Let's get it started. And just so you guys know, watching the cutscenes will give you XP. Or no, I'm not. I'm not 100% sure, but watching the all of the cutscenes will give you a boost, I think, to your second character that you make. So it's definitely worth watching all of the um, all of the cinematics. So let's go ahead and watch them. Annika, the land of many martial artists, but only those who pass the guardians' tests can call themselves a grand master. The Grand Master Trial begins now. Represent your house and prove your worth. All right, we'll do. That all sounds lame. With my powers, you'll become the Grand Master in no time. I demand a redo. I'll show you. Conquer the Guardians with my overwhelming desire. Your competition, Hoden, fell for the demon's tricks. He made a mockery of the sacred trial and angered the Guardians. There is no shortcut to power. It is achieved through hard work and discipline. you demonstrated in abundance you proved yourself worthy of the title Grand Master my daughter you are now champion of the Guardians be 
their light that pierces through the darkness. The real trial begins now. now. Destiny calls for you. Sweet, sweet. Greetings. Hello. Destiny has led you here. Welcome to the edge of the world. Whoa. Now follow the path of the light. Wait. Okay, did I just fuck shit up? Because I want right click to be moved. Yeah, there we go. Oh shit. The forces of chaos are on the move again. The Arts once saved the world from the demons. We need them again. Try opening the Tome of Prophecy. It will show you the path of your destiny. Interact with object. View prophecy. Choose your advanced class. Here we go. Lightweight knuckles, heavy gauntlets, mysterious focus. So I think we're doing War Dancer, and this is the moment of truth. skill buttons to make them yeah I think I'm ready let's do it summon monster real quick and we'll fight it boss real quick okay what do these do you can I am gonna have to change some of these keys I'm not a huge fan of this okay we're gonna end it and we're gonna start Go, war dancer, baby. May Regulus bless the path you've chosen.
Let's go. You will now take your first step in the quest for the Ark. The future of Arcasia is in your hands. The light of the world must not fall to chaos. The heck? We better get moving. Huh? Go? Where? To meet our friends. After five hundred years of waiting, the scars of destiny call to us. Scars of the what? Of the what now? Come back, you crazy old man! True, other forgotten land. Look alive, scrubs. We're here. Sweet. The graphics look really cool. Ride home is next, so please don't get off just yet. Uh, oh, I see. We're going to take off once they. Let's go! <sighs> You're finally. Daily login rewards. Bronze Founders Pack, let's grab it. Black cat, black kitty. Okay, let's familiarize with the UI for a little bit. Alt P. Okay, let's mess with the controls a tiny bit here. Basic controls. Skills. We're going to do W, E, R, C. That's taking it off of sailing ship horn. We don't need that. And then this is going to be Z. X V B is what I usually use for my MMO keybinds. Attack keyboard. Sh 
shape porn. I don't even know what we'll do for these. Uh, attack keyboard. I don't really need an attack if I'm being honest. But we'll make it. Did we bind anything to A? Eh. Okay. So we don't have awakening skill, change HUD, specialty skill. Yeah, that's fine. We'll leave it for now. Morpheus, dude. Green pill or blue pill? Blue pill, red pill. Green pill. Water. You are welcome, my dude. We get you're the captain, Gurkha. Can you chill? Check the map as often as you can. The advance party that came first said they had finished exploring the area. No, wait, I missed it. Shit. All right, boys, I'm back. I just finished okay. like the little tutorial thing. Nice. What did you uh, pick your class? I can't tell you. What? I'm just kidding. <laughs> Shit, what did I pick? I forgot. Once your pet levels, or once you hit a certain like level, your pet does different functions, right? So you get like remote storage, remote repair. That's pretty cool. That's cool. All from yeah. your pet, your pet or remote mail. And I'm guessing some of the pets you can like buy, buy in the store, huh? Yeah, there's like rabbits and shit. Oh, you can rename him too. His name is James. I think that's kind of cool. <laughs> I'm gonna put this food in the oven. Combat feels really cool for sure. Yeah, it's really smooth. I picked a uh, word answer, by the way. You are quite you word answer? I wonder if I should name my cat Cat Jam. <laughs> Definitely. <laughs> the treasure is important, but making it out alive is what truly matters. Make good use of that portion.
we never know what's gonna happen, so it's best to prepare for the worst. Hmm. This way! Everyone gather up! We are going to break through the barrier and advance! Or inventory button? He had to turn on his old camera. By the gods. Wait, who? Yes, and gold. Oh. It's all like low quality. Yeah, it's in garbage to your quality. <laughs> oh, these giant statues were built in the image of the gods. I'm just on the boat now, looking at all the big statue things. I know you guys are probably a bit ahead. I've been taking my time, sorta. Yeah, I'm just... ...kinda overwhelmed by some of this stuff. Yeah, I'm trying to, like, slowly soak it in, like, like the fucking developer said. Yeah, all the fucking bars and menus are gnarly. <laughs> I was like, I'll look at this later! I'll be right back. I'm gonna use the restroom real quick. You gonna flap your gums all day, priest? He's right. We should be quiet. Look, we made it. It doesn't seem normal. Seems like we're on the right track. Follow me and watch it. Oh, you can hear the cat meowing. Meow. It's like meow. It's like a little kitten. I don't know. It's adorable. I don't like how Dash is on an eight second cooldown. Yeah. What's the default hotkey for dash? Space bar. Space bar. Oh, it's just like a standstill dodge? Yeah. Alright, I think it's gonna be a little different for each class. Poor horse. It's dead now. <laughs> I can't believe you destroyed the bridge. What about the others trapped on the other side? Don't whine at me. I actually like how the gear looks a lot, like in the inventory slots. Oh, oh yeah. It looks really yeah, it... fucking clean. I'm glad you're okay. I, the inventory and the sound that the UI makes. Nice. Yeah, totally agree.
Dude, I bet you can see so much on your monitor. And the widescreen is definitely pretty sweet. It's just nice to have like a little bit of distance between all the UI elements of them all being kind of like on top of each other. Yeah. Need to figure out how to get to the house. Pretty sure that shit's like super important to go do it like right away. Your stronghold or whatever? Yeah, because it has like resources that it gains automatically and you want to use them and get it going ASAP. Yeah. Run as fast as you can once you set it up. That thing goes off fast. I hope nothing goes wrong. Okay, yeah, my, my class's spacebar is like a super tiny dash. Yeah, my, my dash doesn't go very far. It's yeah, it's not terribly far. Probably just for like dodge, right? More of a dodge than a dash. Yeah. Yeah, I think you can uh, like spec into it or something. The path, it's open. What is this? Definitely pretty fun. I don't know what I was doing in the closed beta. I played it for like 15 minutes. I was just like, <laughs> nah, I'm not playing this game ever again. Really? Yeah. And it's actually way better than I even remember the beta. No, let's see. Roster level two, whatever that means. We're here. Let's go. I think. 
think the treasure is over there. Hey, wait for me. Must be a secret device that could open the shrine somewhere. Let's find it together. Hmm. Do all classes start in different locations? I don't think so. Okay. Yeah. No, they don't. Oh, there's guilds already. There's one called <clears throat> Weebs. Yep, sounds about right. Bing chilling. What's <laughs> <laughs> up? <laughs> well, we've lost. Holy shit. Whoa. Demons. How did they get here? I think it's kind of like Diablo in the sense that when you're fighting a lot of mobs, it's kind of hard to see what's going on. Yeah. I think yeah. P yeah. PvP arenas is probably a lot better though. They There's also the photo sensitivity mode you can turn off. Oh, did you guys have that turned off? No, I, I didn't do I that. Normally, I, 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 I might turn that off. Normally, yeah. I, I would turn something like that off just so I don't have to strain my eyes yeah that makes sense because it, it looks great when you're not fighting a bunch of mobs yeah yeah my 144 hertz monitor like when shit goes crazy it's like what the fuck <laughs> yeah dude i feel you i have one as well and it's a little weird <laughs> no, don't touch it. i feel like it's almost only good for like shooters yeah. Oh shit, these guys just got fucking wrecked. Stop! It's a trap! Help me! Adventures, Tom. Please, don't let me die. Get back. What? His screams would have killed you both. What the fuck? A skillet? Stand back. What is going on here? Ignea token points reward.
David, does this road lead to? Thanos, just two of us now. I ordered my people to pull out this cliff. Keep an eye to the guard. I don't know, I haven't played the PV at all yet, but it seems like ranged classes will have a pretty big advantage. How do you guys feel? Uh, ranged classes are probably pretty good. I, it just depends on, like, there's a lot of, like, dash ability, like, skills that have, like, grapples and dashes in them. Oh, uh, for, like, gap closing and stuff? Yeah, exactly. Okay. I, I don't know. But it does seem that there's like a few classes that are just dominant PvP. Like Paladin's supposed to be really good mid range. And uh Yeah, Paladin's like broken. Even for damage? Well, not really for damage. <laughs> okay. But they they have uh there's like these things you get, right? And like eventually you'll get like a buff that gives you 10 you and your party gets 10 percent more damage oh shit yeah and then it also reduces like the damage you take by like 30 percent or some shit like that it's pretty broken shit do you see anything um but yeah they said paladin's like one of the lowest next to bard on damage but the cool thing with paladin is you can either play it support or you can play it as crusader which is like your ret paladin and wow Ah, uh, okay, I see. Wait, how do you change your pet's name? Um, you I don't should know be able to how to change name. Yeah, it, uh, it's in the pet thing. Like when you go and inspect your pet or whatever. Oh, if you control. I can't remember how I got there. Click. Oh, my fucking nose is itching. Uh, if you control, control, click on your pet. Oh. You get the little pet info, then you can do rename. Gotcha. Okay, I see it. Thank you. <laughs> do you guys watch It's Always Sunny? No. I, I've seen it a couple times, but not enough to okay. why. Uh, well, there's this, like, junkyard cat that they get in this one episode that they name... <laughs> that they call Agent Jack Bauer. <laughs> <laughs> Jack Bauer from fucking 24. Yep. <laughs> that's great. <laughs> so that's my cat's name. Oh, yeah. Agent Jack Bauer is on the case. Over here. I found it. Take this and go up. I think I'm probably also going to try out one of the, um, what's the range classes? I'm probably going to try out one of the gunner classes too and see which one I like better. I wanted to do artillerist at first, but you're kind of like locked into your skill animations. Yeah, it's. It, I think that that class would probably be super tough for boss mechanics. Yeah. Sharpshooter looks pretty sweet. Yeah, totally agree. I think Sharpshooter and uh, Gunslinger both look really cool. You also get a bird that follows you around as Sharpshooter. Yeah, I saw I, that. It does like fat AoE, huh? Does it? Okay, I thought it only buffed your teammates, but I guess it... I think, huh. I think you can choose one of two paths. There's one that looks like it does like an AoE kind of like vacuum zoom. And then the other one I think is more for buffing. Oh, okay. All I hear are a bunch of cats. Like, people are just walking around and I just hear meow, meow. <laughs> what is the drop that you get? For what? You get the Lola starter item set. Uh, 
I have no idea. Oh, I was just looking at it. Lola. Yep. Halfway to getting it. You went physical defense, right? Yeah. Okay, I'll go magic. Oh, cool. So you can actually freely change that, too. You don't have to, like, grind something out just to change your pet buff. Yep, you just go to that guy and change. Reaches the end of the oh, that's sick. I'll be back in a few, guys. Okay. Alright, All right, guys. Well, it looks like this is the intro. I think every class does this same sort of intro. I don't think it's different for any of the classes or advanced classes. Um, yeah, we'll definitely finish watching this cutscene though for sure. It the movement feels really smooth. I don't know. I haven't played PvP yet. Like I said, I've tried to not play any of the beta content or look into the game or watch gameplay too much because I wanted it to be super fresh when it launched, which I'm very happy for. But I do also have that thing where I'm feeling like I should have done some research. I would have known which classes are good where. But um. I don't know, let me know in the comments if this is not the case, but it seems like ranged are going to have a pretty good advantage. I know this is very low level and not anywhere near endgame, and the um, the movement speed and gap closing and mobility probably gets a lot higher, so melee can gap close, but right now, first look, it seems like range classes are probably going to be very good. I could be totally wrong, like I said, I really don't know, but... um. Yeah, so that is the uh, the beginner's training. Thank you guys very much for watching. If you haven't already, please like and subscribe. I'll definitely be playing a lot of Lost Ark and making videos. I also play a lot of Project Gorgon and, and make videos and run a podcast for that as well. If you don't know what Project Gorgon is, uh, check out some of my other videos. It's an amazing, very intricate and in-depth MMORPG, very old school vibe. Um, it's probably closer to text base and it's extremely fun. I found it about a couple months ago and have been diving into it a lot. But um, yeah, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoy and uh, happy hunting.